Iran president swore in to develop relations with Nigeria. <laughs> Iran president swore in to develop relations with Nigeria. Others, the swearing in ceremony of the president of the Islamic Republic of Iran, Ibrahim Raisi, took place on Thursday at the, nas- at the nation's capital, Tehran. His government plans to develop relations with African countries. Raisi took the oath of office at the parliament before state official and diplomats from over 80 countries, including Nigeria, Ghana, South Africa, and Italy. The wrestler reported that Raisi served as the chief justice of Iran before his victory at the country's presidential poll. Iran's election commission chairman, Jama of Ad had on June 16 announced that he won the country's presidential election after securing 17.8 million votes out of 28.6 million million votes cast. On Thursday, he said that it was a privilege to serve his country to the best of his knowledge. At the beginning of the new century and the beginning of the second step of the revolution, I am very proud to have been entrusted with the protection of such a precious heritage by the vote of the heroic nation of Iran and I thank God Almighty for be, be, for best only, for bestowing his blessing on this servant and gave me a great opportunity to serve the people he said as it published on the iranian iranian government's website parallel to the ceremony rice met with the speaker of the niger republic parliament shen omaro he stated that Iran as African countries as part of its priority. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Iran and Niger should resign and implement should design rather and implement an operational machina mechanism for identifying all potential in the two countries because the development of relations with African countries including Niger will be one of Iran's priorities in the coming term he stated on Wednesday hmm. okay I don't really know what these people uh, meant by saying they are going to create a relation between um, Iran and Nigeria because me this Iran people I'm really really scared of them whenever i hear about them i have goosebumps on my body because the only thing they know about in iran is war and i don't know why nigerians will be eh, 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 will be interested in making friendship with them but anyways we don't know how they want to play this politics but we all know that whatever it is that they are planning will not work on nigerians that is my prayer and hope anyways let's go to comment section and hear people's take on this because i know nigerians will already be boiling for hearing this uh, relation story relation with iran is the last thing nigeria needs especially at this point in time and considering the their situation of nigeria's internal security any upgrade to our existing engagement with iran will only exacerbate a a raging bad situation hmm. with that what is going on in nigeria regarding religious and intolerance and religious based violence nigeria has nothing to gain from such relation with a country known for its harsh and radical uh, hair this is what i'm saying exactly because i don't really think nigeria will really want to have anything to do with a country such as iran but since we have a president like buhari anything is possible because that man doesn't really care about anything of such because him himself is a violent person that is what i know it can only make matters worse observers that is it exactly what has nigeria gained from u.s hypocrisy <laughs> hypocritic that nigeria have been practicing since 1999 to date except corruption criminality and immorality hmm. okay someone here is saying come with your own rain enrichment er- we need that to power our nation electric and also build first african nuclear weapons program hmm. we have 
we have the land and the sea to store a large number of nuclear warheads. Hey! New dimension of terrorism is in offing. Hmm. Terrorist nation. I hope relationship with Buhari will not create more terrorism in the north and Nigeria as a whole. Hmm. People are saying, whatever people are saying, the Muslims or the northern people rather, they will come out and start being biased and criticizing what people are um, stating whenever someone is stating the obvious just because someone is saying here that um the um, relation with iran is the last thing nigeria wants someone here is saying he said his name is ahmad seto siddiq that a uh, since nigeria has been has been with um us that what has nigeria great um what has nigeria gained from them apart from hypocrisy so tell me what we should do when we nigerians ourselves are not even um we are not even united so tell me when um nigeria is not even going to divide because with all these things going on new dimension of terrorism that is what is going to happen this shows you don't know anything about terrorism in this world just don't comment for typing sake hmm. you are only born to be evil throughout your life if that is what you have in mind shame on you for how long will you continue to be in darkness for any good <laughs> For any good things, you can't see why. Can't you see the misguided word of your mouth in haunting you everywhere you are? Think. Hmm. Who is Iran before Nigeria? It is because of their advance in weaponry. Intact, intact our field us indeed. Hmm. Okay. People are saying, please, Iran is religious, ignorant, intolerant. They are deadly in thinking, arrogant in handling of weapons. Hmm. Both chemical, biochemical and biological and nuclear weapons please we don't need a relationship with a terrorist country hmm. this new regime will start increasing their uranium enrichment like that of his preced uh, like that of his procedures hmm. relation with iran will only make us a uh, harder in terrorism they will surely turn nigeria to their proxy arena they'll be making our country a launching pad against western world which they always perceived as their enemy if there need be for us to have ties with them it has to come with tough law and regulation that is where to go or not hmm. exactly anyways i really know that the president is going to think about it before um, um stretching forth his hand for uh, um, friendship towards the people of iran because we all know that these people hmm, they has no conscience and we are really really scared if the if our president should stretch out friend, hands of friendship with people of iran we don't know what is going to befall this country as it stands right now we already have the issue of um security in our country insecurities everywhere people are dying and we hear story of um, Boko Haram headsmen and banditry, so on and so forth. So if our president just stretch forth his hands of friendship towards the people of Iran, then definitely he will be questioned because hey, the things that those people are known for are definitely going to affect um, Nigeria because there is a saying that show me your friends and I'll tell you who you are. So I think Buhari really needs to be careful of the kind of people he stretched forth his hand of friendship to. Anyways, you can go to the comment section and share your take on this article. Thanks for listening. God bless you.